Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you an all-in-one AI tool that replaces multiple platforms at once. I'm talking full access to powerful models like VO3, Kling 2.6, Sora 2 Pro, and Hailuo Minimax, plus the ability to generate insanely realistic 4K images using Google Nano Banana. This tool genuinely shocked me. And by the end of this video, you'll understand why it can completely change your content creation, editing, and AI workflow. So make sure you watch till the end. And before we start, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications. So once you've installed the Edimacore tool, this is how the interface looks. There are many tools available, and if you move over to the left a little, you'll see an icon called Toolbox. When you click on it, you can see all the tools Edimacore offers. This honestly makes your editing and workflow so much better because there's no need to jump from one tool to another, from video tools to audio tools, to image tools, and even text tools. All of these are built into one place, along with some template-based tools that are absolutely mind-blowing and surprisingly amazing. But don't worry guys, I'm going to walk you through the tool and its features step by step. So stick with me and let's get started. We'll begin with the text to image feature. I clicked on it and it took me to an editor style interface. And over on the top left corner, you'll see different image generator models like Google Nano Banana Pro, Sea Dream 4, which is Google's competitor, and some other models you can try out. But for this demo, we're going with Google Nano Banana Pro. As you can see, I typed in a simple prompt, chose the resolution as 2K HD, selected a suitable aspect ratio, although you can choose whatever works best for you, then moved over to the number of images and selected two. After that, I clicked generate, and honestly guys, my jaw dropped when I saw the results. This is crazy. The hyperrealism is very clear, and what excited me the most was the detailing, especially the name of the cafe and the consistency of the people, including the main subject. Next, we tried the image to video feature, and instead of going back to the toolbox, if you look over to the right, because we want to use the image we just generated, you'll see an option to generate video. Later on, we'll check out text to video, but for now, after clicking it, I adjusted the image to my desired aspect ratio, and personally, I stuck with the original ratio. Once it finished uploading, I described what I wanted in the video and decided to keep it simple. Sorry, I almost skipped this part. If you scroll up a bit, you'll see where you can choose your video model. And Edimacore supports all the popular and powerful ones like Kling 2.6 and 01, Google VO3, which is honestly a Google killer model, Sora 2 Pro, and Hailuo Minimax, but I decided to go with Hailuo because it's the newest one. I went ahead and generated the video, loaded for a couple of seconds, and the result came out exactly how I wanted it, laughing naturally, using hand gestures, and talking with her friend, and most importantly, it maintained the image details I mentioned earlier. Next up, we tested another feature called Face Swap, and this tool gives you the option to do either a single face swap or multiple face swaps, but I'll just show you how the single face swap works. You start by importing the image or video you want to perform the face swap on. I uploaded a picture directly from my computer, then if you scroll down a bit, you can import the face you want to swap with, but I chose one of the built-in faces. After that, you click Facial Recognition, which analyses the face you uploaded and prepares it for swapping. And once that's done, all you need to do is click Start Face Swapping and wait a little while for it to process. As you can see, it's done already and it performed really nicely. I honestly can't see any distortion with the naked eye, and the realism is impressive. Now let's move on to another amazing feature called AI Effects. This section is packed with AI templates that we see going viral on TikTok, Instagram, and even YouTube Shorts, with so many effects to choose from, and I decided to go with the 3D Figure Factory, which is one of the most popular effects on YouTube Shorts right now. I uploaded the image I wanted to use, previewed it, selected my desired aspect ratio, adjusted my settings, and clicked Generate, and I'll let you guys judge the result for yourselves. because you honestly can't deny the hyper-realistic nature of it. Now, like I promised, let's try the text-to-video feature. Normally I go with the Hailuo Minimax model, 
but you can use any other model if you prefer. You simply type your text prompt into the box, adjust the settings to your liking, and hit generate. And just look at how realistic the result comes out. Clean, detailed, and genuinely impressive. I even tried another prompt, and the results were just as good. Sharp, clean, and high quality. So what are you waiting for? Go ahead and try out this editor for yourself. Don't forget to share your experience in my Discord channel. And that'll be all for this one.